it is another beautiful day and welcome back to my kitchen if today is the first time here this is lena and we do easy cooking recipes if you are interested do not hesitate to subscribe or follow for more videos and if you want more fish recipes oh my goodness you are the right place because we eat a lot okay different types uh -huh. so you are the right place to my returning ones thank you for always watching my videos so in today's video this is the fish i'm bringing you for you to know the name of the fish watch the video till the end <laughs> that is just by the way so i'm just going to clean it perfectly and then we can continue but if you go to the central part of ghana this is called opening emisa opening emisa okay yes that is the name opinion emisa so if you've been eating opinion emisa today you are going to know the english name for opinion emisa yeah we used to sell this and trust me this type of fish aha, <laughs> was very very expensive those days that those days that i i used to fry fish and sell it was very very expensive it tastes so good and if you use it to prepare light soup oh my goodness you will bite your teeth <laughs> can that be possible that is just by the way i just want to tell you that it is so good please do well to follow me on all social media platforms at exhibiting mommy's recipe so we are done removing the intestine and then any part that we don't want for now normally when we are preparing it we fold it just like how you are seeing on the screen so that is how my mother used to do okay so i will just go ahead and fold it like that it is not something difficult and comparing this to built fish the teeth are not sharp they are not as sharp as um built fish okay yes so I'm just going to cut that part away too, okay? It is very meaty for me, so I'll cut it away. And I'm done folding everything. This is how they look. I'm just going to cut that part away. You can decide not to cut it. Today, I'm in a good mood, so I decided to cut it. Sometimes, I do not, okay? So, I'll just go ahead and cut it this way, and then we can continue. If you want short videos, oh my goodness, follow me on TikTok instagram and my youtube shorts we upload detailed video and recipes there trust me you will love it okay yeah so we are done this is how we are going to attend to all the other ones and then i will get back to you so i'll be with you shortly after i'm done behind camera okay i'm going to continue behind camera mm behind camera <laughs> i said <love> behind camera <laughs> behind camera okay i've i've yeah, added some lemon juice okay and i'm just going to let it stay for maybe a minute and then add some water to it and then clean it or wash it again very well and I will get back to you. After I was done, I'll just add my salt. I will add my salt. Don't worry about the one that has opened. When I'm about to drop it in the oil, I'm going to fold it perfectly again. I will add my all-purpose seasoning. If you don't want it, please omit it, okay? But it helps the fish, okay? It adds some flavor, taste, and also remove the fishy um i mean smell from the fish okay i that was my all purpose flour and my cayenne pepper okay or chili pepper so now after 25 to 30 minutes i have strained the water from the fish and they are resting in my colander now they look dry and when i fry it it is not going to give me a lot of work i mean the place will be messy but it will reduce okay so this was what i was talking about the all-purpose flour and my cayenne pepper i'll just coat the fish with this and then start frying have you liked the video if you haven't can you do so for me 
they don't take money. And the most important thing I want you to do is to leave me a comment. I will be very, very happy if you do so for me. Thank you so much. Now the oil is very hot and then I will just go ahead and drop my fish. Then we are good to go. Thank you. After we are done dropping everything, we are going to fry that side that is directly to the pan. When it becomes brown, it means it is ready. And we are just going to flip it to the other side that is not direct to the pot. I mean, just like this. Okay, so that we can get that perfect fish. You don't have to turn it if it is not ready for it to be turned. Else, it is going to scatter so i always tell you that if you as soon as you hear the sound ta, 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 you know that it is ready for you to turn turn the face okay or just keep an eye on it and when it is brown at the other side you flip it to the one the other side that that was not um direct to the pot so that you will not scatter your fish i added that fish to it because i this was actually the first time i was frying this fish and i wasn't sure whether it was opening a misa so i added that in case <laughs> it does not taste good I, I would take that i know my husband will eat anything <laughs> <laughs> that's just by the way so now it, it is ready okay yes it is ready but we just want it to become a bit dry then we can proceed or remove it from the oil if you've watched me to this point and you haven't subscribed yet can you please subscribe for more videos and then share our videos or this particular video to more people so that we can get a lot of views or reach wider audience now it is ready just look at how crispy the outside looks and the inside was very juicy if you use it for light soup oh my goodness it is so good okay and that was my plan b fish <laughs> yeah now the fish is ready just look at that oh my goodness it looks so delicious looks so perfect and you will love it if you see this anywhere just buy it it is good so i come your way next time always remember i love you take good care of yourself and love yourself first you are important than any other person okay take good care of yourself and love yourself first see you in the next one i love you bye bye <laughs>